dampers, it's the gainer again. Um, it's my second card of the night. Uh, you'll probably see them both tomorrow, which will be the day you're watching them. So, how confusing thing is that? But I've decided to do another little flat, fun flat fold card, and it's just so sweet. And that's it. It's just so stinking gorgeous. And I don't know where I had this embossing folder from, but um, I'm, I've used it anyway. So, like I say, nothing goes to waste. But how gorgeous. It just frames. And I, and I put the happy birthday up high so you don't see it after, before it says, I'm wishing you ridiculous amounts of happiness. Um, and I've used my cottage greeting, which if you're quick, you can still get, but it is on the retirement list. How sweet and adorable is this? You've got congrats, thanks, wishing you ridiculous amounts of happiness, happy birthday, hope your day is wonderful, I'd be lost without you, and you are amazing. And I love the little flowers, and I've used my marker pens to do the flowers, so I can get um, the leaves and the flowers. So here goes, you're going to need a piece of, uh, this is my elegant eggplant and this is seven and three quarters by four and an eighth because we get two sheets you get a piece of whisper white then which is four by five and a quarter that's for the inside you're going to need another piece of um, elegant eggplant which is three by two and a half and another piece of whisper white which is two and three quarters by two and a quarter this is where your little flap is on the front and a piece of designer series paper. I haven't got nothing in elegant eggplant, so I use Wisteria Wonder, which is two by four. Simple, lovely little card. So let's fetch the trimmer in. You do need to, like I say, seven and three quarters by four oh, no, and an eight. And I'm going to score this at two and a quarter. Whoops, I wasn't all the way at the top. Remove the cutting blade. Knowing my luck, I'd cut straight through it. But there's your little flap. How the how Beautiful and quick. Like I say, it's a, it's a little fun fold card, but with a flap, basically. So, and I'm going to burnish that. I'm going to set that to one side and we're going to attach our designer series paper now. This is two by four again. It's just uh, just so sweet. It breaks up the card. Um, and this goes on our lovely little flap. Nice little border all the way around. There we go, we can set this to one side now. I'm going to come in with my inks now and I'm using the Elegant Eggplant as well. And I'm going to stamp my happy birthday first. Beautiful colour. And I'm, not, I'm taking it about a quarter of the way down the page. How crisp, it's lovely and the crisp, clear, it's a beautiful stamp set. Um, now we're going to fetch in this uh, wishing you ridiculous amounts of happiness. How sweet is that to give to somebody? Just absolutely gorgeous. And this is going towards the top. clean and crisp yet again it's absolutely stunning well that's it with the ink pad and I'm going to fetch in my markers and my two lovely little stamps um, I'm going to do the leaf and the stem in green and because the markers are nice and juicy if you're quick you can get them done And I'm going to put one either side of uh, my little say, how sweet. 
a little notch up there, so be careful. And the flower. And if they do dry out, just huff at them and it'll activate the ink again. And moisten. How stunning. So that's that one. And I'm going to do the same here. The leaves and these little green dots around the top. And my flower in the... Sorry, I don't think you can see that. I'm going to do one there, come back in, it takes seconds, it doesn't take long, um, and you couldn't stamp it on a stamp pad without, I'm going to turn that around so it faces you the other way, how sweet, that's it. And if, even if you do make it, you can always turn these over, the borders, just go over. No one's going to know. Beautiful. Done. So we can, oh, right, well I, I know it's not stamping up, but it's the only one I got with a border all the way around. So I'm going to pop this in here. Making sure I get my pattern in. Kept in my big shot. Um, I've only got I've got the big shot platform for the embossing folder with a cutting mat, and that one goes on the top. And we're just gonna send this through the big shot, but. Stamping up do some wonderful, wonderful um, embossing folders for framing. It's just I haven't seemed to have got them all yet, so let's get this out of the way. I'm sure you'll find, oh, but look how pretty that looks. And just another dimension to your card. So I'm going to attach this to the inside of my card. Look how sweet that is. And any of you lovely ladies and gents out there that do want to start shopping with me, if you could add your birthday, your date of birth, um, when you fill out the order form, I can send you a birthday card as well. How sweet would that be? Personalised birthday card of yours truly. So Get filling in those dates of birth. You don't even have to put the year if you don't want to, unless you want me to send you a numbered one. How sweet is that? It's just the perfect amount. I am going to fetch my silver ribbon in again. I do love this stuff. I'm going to double that up. And I, this was free with the celebration, but it's come, I know it's come to the end, but... Uh, Use them. Don't have them and just put them down and think, oh, I can't use them again. It's a liberation's over. Use them. Trust me. Right, I need to turn that the other way. So I always get my uh, keep twisting. That's it. I will pop that straight in a moment. But I'm only doing a little... Uh, I'm terrible with bows, so you know me and bows don't mix. I know that's coming loose now, so pull it tight. Oops, there we go. Pull this where you want it. How oh, sweet. And then we can trim off the ends. How gorgeous is that? I am going to get a glue dot and just stick it under the knot. 
so it doesn't get in the way and it doesn't move around. It keeps it in place. How pretty is that? But look at that. Isn't that lovely? Oh, I hope you all give it a go and send me your photos. I absolutely adore that. Well, I'm now going to attach that with some dimensions. I just need two. How quick was this card? You tell people you're going to make a fancy fold, fun, flappy fold card. And they're like, oh no, I can't, I can't. You can. It's just so simple. And I'm going to even this now. Either side. Give me a, an equal board either side. And level if I can. Looks a bit slanted. Perfect. Now, everyone likes a little bit of bling. <laughs> I know I do. Isn't it? I'm going to have to order more rhinestones. I cut the paper down and tear it off. Just add one to the centre of each of these. Look, perfect fit. Look. I hope you like this one as well. Um, thumbs up would be fantastic and a share would be amazing knowing you can uh, share it with your friends as well let them know what you enjoy watching um how sweet i don't think i've left anything off how gorgeous is that you can add um you could always go over this with wink of stella just over the raised areas but i think because of the detail it says enough so that's the one I've just made with you now, and this is the one I did before. How stinking cute are those cards? Yay! Right, um, don't forget to press the subscribe button, and um, you'll get notified then each time I make a video, which, which is quite often just lately. Um, so that would be a main force, and... Like I say, if you want to go to the shop, follow the link to the shop now button. Uh, there is a retirement list there of everything that's going to be going soon and it won't be coming back. So if you want something in particular, you need to get your order in now because it's going to be cut. Once they're gone, they're gone as well. So if you can get your orders in before May 31st, the new catalogue's coming out on June the 2nd. Either the 1st or the 2nd. And I can't wait. So, uh but if, you, if there is anything you want, there was a lot of things in the spring and summer catalogues that were in there, but are now going. So if there was something in those little catalogues you enjoyed, grab it now. And you'll probably get it at a discounted rate as well. I'm not guaranteeing it, but some of the items have been discounted as well. So if you want a bargain and you want to catch something before it runs out, then go to my shop and click shop now. And on the left-hand side, next to... Um, the item list it says retirement list so have a look in there so but thanks for watching thanks again bye